to the light bearers, bearers, I say, or those I will choose as a light bearer. For I have many, I have many, many, many humans. Those rewards that I supposed to receive is not but I don't want any of it. You have no idea how much so-called reward I have because all that should have been mine. Why? No one works as except the ten prophets or what you call ten commandment. The same prophets, the same apostles as the two Elijah and Melchizedek who come down to me at the mountain. When Peter fell to sleep when I was praying, you know, the spirit of our father talked to me and said unto them, This is my son. Listen to him. You know? I am here to choose or now he is saying the same. This is my thought. Listen to this. For the light bearers, as my son have many, 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 more than many. Does not want any of her reward, so-called reward. I am picking who can have the diamonds that she give to I, a father. I rubies that she give to I, the mother. The golds, she have many chests that she knows already. But this R will be given for the worthy who will become L-I-G-H-T-B-E-A-R-E-R-S. As it stated in Philippians 2, Light Berer. Therefore, my beloved, as you have always obeyed, not as in my presence only, but now much more in my absence, that is before, work out your own salvation with fear and trembling, for it is I who works in you, both to will and to do for his good pleasure. Why good pleasure? Because he always suffer every time you like be rares. Curse. Cause. Swear. He bleeds as you are a light bearer. That is what you do, harming him every time you. You notice that I could not even say a thing? Why? Unless I have to get rid of that curse, I say it. Sometimes I say it the other way to balance me. That is why you cannot read, you cannot hear me cursed unless I have to left a curse. Because the Lord is getting punished by your harsh words. Do all things without complaining and disputing that you may become blameless and harmless children of God without fault in the midst of a crooked and perverse generation among whom you shine as lights in the world. Among you shines as light in the world. Remember the true prophets. This shines as light in the world. Remember Elijah. He was chased. All the prophets, true prophets, remember what happens to them. And look at those prophets now. 
they don't work for their blameless and the harmless to be to work for their own salvation you think they are working because they are preaching the word of god no they don't instead they are blaming and blaming and blaming and blaming and harming and harming and harming you have done that you know if you want to be blameless and harmless as to be called children of my father without fault in the midst of a crooked and perverse, perverse generation. This is the perverse generations. Do all things without complaining as disputing as the Lord did. He does not complain when you make him suffer through by your harsh words. Being proud through your words. You know? You must. If we talk about rewards, I have. And it is reality reward that you will receive. But change thy ways because I do not like to see my Lord bleeding. You know, enough that he have suffered every time the light bearers, the angels, the saints, the prophets in the body does these things. Why? Because this is the crooked, perverse generation. You know? The words aren't just in your mouth. It already is. Been trusted. H R U S T to your chest, meaning to say there is already a meat into your words that does not go out empty. You know, that is how I cope things because when I cursed. You see, even every time I, uh, sometimes I have to reverse the word, like the word T-H-I-S, reverse that. It's shit, right? I could not even say that. I have to reverse it first before I do so. Why? For it not to blaspheme as the light Among whom you shine as lights in the world, holding fast the word, I am the word. Every time you curse, these are the words that I have read out, not to touch my light. Why? Because those words, cursed words, swear words, is not life, deadly you know, deadly, why? It does not go out empty. Because it comes from your chest. It comes from your chest. So that you may rejoice in the day of the Lord that you have not run in vain or labored in vain. Yes, and if I poured out all the drink offering on the sacrifice and service of your faith. That is the reward. Sacrifice and service of your faith. I am glad and rejoice with you. For the same reason, when you humble yourself, the Lord is heals from his anger. Remember, he is full of his wrath. I am the spirit of him, condemning those who have killed the true prophets. You know? It's still, it's, we're going into that because right now, the judgment on the pastors is condemned. You know? 
You want to be my father's light bearers. Obeyed what is being instructed to you for your for your work not to run in vain that you may not labor in vain because every time you cause every time you swear every time you curse is a spell us Philippians 2 17 16 you are holding fast to the word that is not light curses swearing like i said i knew what comes out from your mouth i knew what comes out from your head it comes out from your chest what you go through into the room is a prayer not a word of your ancestrals cursing and swearing and all that that is Raphael balance him why his mother was blamed his father was killed you know Saint Thomas the apostle and Raphael was Daniel he was to David he was to the song of Solomon's how he balanced himself his ancestrals never know how to curse you know so he himself is lifting that curse from those that people been blamed like his mother for that's the worst sin that the humans have done blaming at Mama Magdalene the all things without complaining and disputing that you may become blameless and harmless as children of my father without fault in the midst of the crooked and perverse generation you know without crooked because that is I am I am so angered into this around me surroundings but in the midst of that, I can only speak to the Lord in my heart, in my chest, not out loud. Like that daily, when I see my video, somebody only comment blaming me. I keep posting and posting and posting and posting and posting and posting to get rid that blame that they are trying to. As I am the word of life. You know? Every day. That's what I do. Why, why I am posting. Instead of saying it out loud. I keep posting and posting and posting it. I don't care who read it. I don't care who sees it. Does not matter. All I need to do is to get rid of that word of veins into my as I am the word of life that you may rejoice in the day of my you know of my what is it of my once in this works that I am doing I am contributing who can be rewarded as we're finished cleansing the spirits that have been demonized. But the souls, there's many devilized in the souls. Is that what you want to receive, the devilized souls? Listen to Gecko. He's too far from me, but still hearing what I say. For he is a spirit. You know? Every time I wake up and see, oh, there's only a few people that looked at my video, listen to it. It makes me feel bad. Why? Because this isn't work, this isn't for me. This work is not for I, but for those who can be the light bearers through that names that I have 
is spiritually in my through my father and um, you know that we have baptized there is also a reward through that you know i never come here and uh, every words causing people all that because that is a word of this generation cursing and cursing and cursing and cursing you know no matter what you need in the day that you were born let's say starting of that perverse generation a crooked and perverse generation s 1930 1930 is the start of the crooked and perverse generation cursing that is what it is cursing wherever you go even children knows how to curse it is a spell that you are putting into others don't you know that it's not word of it's not life life is without you cursing the lord that are with me for what i see is what they see what they hear is what i hear you know what they plan is what i hear what i hear is from them you see don't let your labor from the past go in vain don't ruin everything that you have done before just because of these perverse generations that have crooked your souls you know yes I have been through a lot in my life more than you can bear I was battered B E T T E R E D I jumped in the 10 feet wall because of the people that I have helped that backstabbed me and throw me out the house that is a symbol reversing of that when I was Easter as well 10 feet I was pushed into the pool with my passport in the other land I only cry I don't fight back you know I don't fight back it taught me so much because that is how you are forged through the harsh lessons in life without fighting back you know without fighting back because there's nothing you know many things happens to me you have no idea of what I've been through is spiritually physically soulfully frequently imagine that even the the woman who called this flesh of mine tries to kill me you have no idea how it feels to be sorcerized or exercised you have no idea you have no idea how the devil have tried and tried and tried its best to stop me from finishing this job imagine that he gives me allergic reaction to things that i wasn't i wasn't uh, allergic before you know why because the devil lives within every time he cursed others that is the devil that you are following and not my father nor my mother that are leading every humanity to me because only i can save you from the lord as i am you know i am Rahila, the angel that he loved, you know, 
the angel that he cursed. He looked to see if I could fight back. Never. I never fight back with my Lord. Even with all those that I've been through life. Harsh, 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 harsh words. Harsh lessons, etc., etc., etc. I never fought back. I never learned to curse others. Why? Because in the end of the day, I am the woman that he had given his heart. Why? Because Lord cannot be loved. You know? Cannot be loved as he was the here into the throne. For that is God's ways is. We cannot be loved. So we love the people we loved. You know, it's like when someone loved this person that I have loved before. That is God's ways. When the time I could still love and in this end I couldn't love. I let my fear and trembling in you to make me feel how much you love the Lord. You know? All those things I went throughout to love the Lord as my son. Because this is what we are, you must. The so-called love is softness to us without work. You know, without work, if you cannot bear your sufferings and you keep doing things while complaining and disputing, how much more we will give you punishment because daily bread, you are being punished for a reason. Just as I was. Imagine my own Lord cursed me when I already did everything he does. You know? Everything he does. As he is the heir into the thrones, instead of him showing me a love, softness, as the world thinks that love is softness, he showed it to me the other way around. You know, he should love the other way around, not softness. Through by suffering. As this is the first generations, he tested me also. If I could, you know, fight for his. Instead of us whining, complaining, and disputing, show the Lord that you can do it what he went through as the body of Christ. Because the day I received the body, as I, he suffered as I suffered. You know? That you think only you go through into what you're going through. No. Just imagine. Instead of love, he showed me curse. So don't do the same what the Lord do because he is teasing your life as word of. I am L-I-F-E. Curses is what I get rid of me. I never learned. My mother did not taught me that as I keep telling this. You know? My grandmom, she is my spiritual mother. You know? Honor your ancestors. If you learn that the curse as your ancestrals already been... <laughs> If your ancestral ancestrals does not know how 
ha, is not the one who cursed God before, you won't go through what you did. Because my ancestrals, one of my ancestrals did this. You know, one, only one. How much more if two tribes of your ancestrals did this to the Lord? So, you punished. Your punishment is from your ancestrals. Remember that. That is one of those that he said that uh, um, children won't go unpunished. 